I'm out. <laughs> yeah, I'm really happy to be outside again after being uh, housebound for so long. Hi, I'm Grateful Ted. Thanks for being here because I really appreciate you being here. And uh, today we're going to a place down about 40 minutes from my house. It's the Oregon High Desert Museum. And there is an Andy Warhol exhibit too there we're gonna see. So come along, let's go see what we can find out about the museum, I've never been there, and uh, Andy Warhol's exhibit. So we're getting ready to go into the museum here. One thing you should know about Central Oregon on the east side of the Cascades, it's a high desert plateau and it's a outdoors person's dream. We've got spelunking and fly fishing and mountain climbing during the summer. We are skiing, sn snowboarding, snowshoeing in the winter. And then we have an indoor stuff like this that you can come and see. So it's a real uh, interesting place and I enjoy living here. Let's go see the Central Oregon Museum. So this is a 1914 Model A Ford. That's an old gas pump. So here's a stagecoach. in honor of the legendary Sourdough Sam. This is the North American porcupine. And this is Andy Warhol's endangered species pop art. Let's go take a look. 
He carried on his shoulder a Siamese cat. Ain't it hard when you discover that he really wasn't where it's at? All of these are Andy Warhol originals. Here's a skull of a human, but uh, could be, this is an endangered species these days. Again, these are all Andy Warhol originals. There's a, a loop trail around the property. There are birds of prey exhibits, live birds of prey. We're headed to the otter exhibit right now. Somebody told me to be sure to see the otters, so that's where we're headed. This is the outside portion of the otter habitat. and other critters like honey badgers and stuff like that. So these are semi-aquatic weasels. That's really the way of looking at, a, at an otter. It's a semi-aquatic weasel. The otter show comes on at 1 p.m. in the afternoon, and I'm filming this on a Sunday. The guy that's doing the show tried to coax the otters out multiple times, but since it's Sunday, they decided, eh, we're going to take a nap. In the spring and summer, there's a whole lot less snow, probably more activity out here.
down there. I'm not sure it's showing up in the film. Notice the chipmunk has stripes across the eyes, the squirrel does not. So that was the Central Oregon High Desert Museum. I hope you liked it. And it's really affordable. And I think that most people would enjoy it. I know kids would enjoy it. If you liked it, hit the like button. And I could always use subscribers. I'm still trying to get that magic 1,000 subscribers. And uh, if you subscribe, hit the like, uh, the bell because that'll let you know when a new post comes up. We've got some art coming on for the next two weeks, if I got my schedule correctly. I think you'll find it quite interesting. One of them is really people-oriented, and one of them is really psychedelic. In any case, we will see you next week.